so so we are going out I am going to outside and Jen is going to the church We stay in this hotel for one for one night because it's expensive. It's a uh, thirty twenty seven dollar, but it's nice. The breakfast is included. Now this is the third time that we're going to eat in this restaurant. We like it here. Sarado. So this is a, like a coffee shop, they have a books here and, and they have a meal selection like rice meal. We order food based on the picture, this one. So it's, this is the one with the pork, salad, pickles, rice and soup and this. This the pork is uh, marinated with something like uh, I don't know. It should taste good. It's always good with rice. And this one is the pickled. Uh, so the snow is uh, sour. Good. And the soup. How many carne palaya? Say, buto yung. Delicious. So we eat here. Uh, John is going to the church with his uh, brother and the family. And I am going to somewhere in the riverside. So this is the Russian market. Here you see different products, meat, dry goods, and fish, everything. <laughs> the Caltex but in Cambodia. As we go. And by just walking, I reach this place. This is the Independence. Uh, I forgot. What is that? Look, there's one lady here doing the painting. Oh yeah, I remember the name of the place is Independence Monument. So around this Independence Monument Park, you're going to see a lot of people that are jogging, working out, and trying to lose their weight. So I was trying to cross the street, but I'm observing first because I see there are some police on the other side. Maybe I'll be jaywalking. So yeah, I see that a lot of people are passing by, are crossing, so I can cross also. So it's good to see that there's a lot of people that are playing in here. There are also a lot of uh, like alfresco restaurant and there are food stalls on the side. And there is also a children's playground on this side of the park. So most of the country here in Asia, especially the uh, country with the Buddhist religion, they have this kind of structures that is, looks amazing. You don't see this in the Philippines. In the development of this uh, Cambodian park, 
there is a big support from the Japanese government as you can see the Japanese flag there it says that the project for flood protection and drainage improvements in Nongpin capital city face Japan's grant aid project it's getting dark and this is how it looks at night Survive. Uh, the design of this tuk tuk is nice. Amazing. So this is the Mekong River. It is uh, like an interboundary uh, river. This one connects to China, Cambodia, Vietnam, and another countries here in Southeast Asia. If this is clean, it will be amazing. But it's a lot of garbage. I love to be in a place like this. There's a lot of people. So I would say that if you are here in Cambodia for nightlife, here in Phnom Penh, the best place to stay here is here in uh, the river side. Because in here, you will see the nice view of the river. And there's a lot of uh, guest house and hostel on this side. Also, the bars and nightclub is located just across the street. So, this is the best place to stay. This is a night market. And they have a live singer on the stage. This is something that I really like. Watching something like that is what I really enjoy and I like it. So they can sit and eat on the floor. They just put something on the floor. It's nice. So you can see the people they are eating very happy. Fresh lumpia, vegetable and pork. So I think it's already 8 o'clock in the evening and there's still a lot of people on this side of this park. I started from the riverside and I'm reaching this place. Within the city, you're going to see a lot of scooter or motorcycle. This is usually their private uh, way of transportation. And some people, this scooter, they called moto which is the one they use for passenger and then the other one is the tuk-tuk which is a, a passenger car usually they, this uh, scooter they attach a carriage and that is the taxi that they are using in the city there are some real taxi but very few I am very careful and very cautious when it comes to the place like this because most of the complaint that I've read on the internet is the snatchers they are basically riding in the motorcycle and they will just take your bag or your phone or your camera 
so I am very careful about that. And I'm back. So still I didn't have my dinner. So I will have maybe just the same like last night the instant noodles from here. And finally I'm home and I bought this from downstairs. And the same like last night it's instant noodles and I bought this uh, pumi grenade oh, yeah, I think it's okay and I have some bread here so I will eat that one for my dinner I didn't able to eat in the restaurant because I feel that it's a lonely way of eating <laughs> so oh, huh? so that's it for today thank you for watching guys ciao